Good morning, it's Celia. Uh, I am, today will be considered my first work week at the new salon. And everything's awesome and amazing. Everything is going according to plan. I have my, um, I have my stuff set up to do the credit cards on my iPad. I used a, um, sales view app. It got the most ratings and Preston told me I need to go by who has the best ratings um, rather than what the first one is. And it's recommended by iPad um, to use it and it turns out it is um, I start, signed up for it on Tuesday and I've been busy in Slack but I have it all set up it was all set up as of yesterday to be able to accept credit cards wherever I am at. So I am mobile now, even though State Board does not approve that. So I will probably just be doing hair in the salon. But if you forget to pay me, which that's not going to happen because bitches have to pay. You can, I can just come to you. I'll stock you down. Hire my bounty hunter have him take your credit card. Um, anyways, um, yeah, so I used the sales view thing and it was really easy and simple. Um, I, when I went to set up my business account after I had already signed up for the sales view stuff, um, cause I couldn't decide if I wanted to use my personal bank account or a business account. And the guy who was representing me through, uh, the people who made the sales view app, it's called Mer Mercury, the guy who was representing me through that, um, told me that I should probably just go ahead and, um, it'd be easier for me to get a business account. I still haven't gotten an LLC. I still don't know if I want to do that. Um, it's $500. Um, I'm a sole proprietor. Everybody I've talked to said that sole proprietors are not required to have an LLC. But I have mixed feelings about it, and I haven't decided if that's if that's the route I want to go. I wish I had a lawyer. I need a lawyer to come into the salon. I need to start cutting lawyers' hair, so that way I can be like, "Hey, let me ask you about this. What's your lawyer opinion?" Of course, he's probably gonna tell me to do it because that's his job, and he'd make some money off of me. But um. Yeah, so anyways, that is the company and everything I've used for that. I am frustrated. I'm super frustrated with um, my distributor. Um, I put an order in last week. Everything's paid for and everything. And my back bar stuff still has not come in. I decided to go with Design Pulse by Matrix. It is like a newer, edgier line that they have out um, made for... It's strictly a styling line. And then I'm also using the Total Results by Matrix. Um, but because my stuff hasn't come in, I've been using Sexy Hair. And Sexy Hair is awesome. And it's it's fabulous. I love it. But I like to... I use Matrix Color. I would like to use Matrix Back Bar stuff. It's just frustrating that... Because they design certain things to go with their color and they design everything to go with their color and it's just frustrating um this morning I have one of my favorite ladies mamas coming in uh Miss Samantha Gilly's mom um and Sam will be coming in with her Samantha just started at the some makeup academy online I'm a horrible friend that I can't remember the name um but she has tons of tutorials on the YouTubes. Um, her username is Psycho Bitches 2686. I will put a little link down there for you to get a little, little click on, a little click action on uh, if you want to check it out. Um, so she can tell you, and she also has some vlogs about her journey and things like that. Um, I would love, I'm trying to get it to where me and her can maybe collaborate on some things, um, some videos and collaborate business-wise and stuff like that. Um, maybe get a photographer up in here, um, and, or we can just, 
she can do a tutorial on me. I can do one on her. I can demonstrate how to use certain products, like if people don't know, or how to do certain things at home with certain styles and certain cuts and things like that with her. She is pretty cool. Um, one of my favorite people, actually, ever. Um, one of my favorite people. I think in my last video, I said the Zero Prince is my favorite person. So, don't get that confused, because the Zero Prince is my favorite person, ever. Samantha Gilly is one of my favorite people. But she's up there, and probably, like, top five. So, but Zero Prince is number one. Uh, he's awesome. I think you guys know that. Um, and I have, it is Saturday, and I have a full book today. It makes me feel good that people are following me. Um, my first client, um, actually Samantha's mom is my second client, but my first client is my first regular ever. Um, I've been doing hair about six years, but I did take a little bit of a break, um, and that's a long story, um, but I took a little bit of a break and start, went to business school and all that nonsense, um, but my first client ever, her name is, I'm not gonna tell you her name, actually, um, well, I will, because I'm not gonna tell you her last name, so I can tell you her name. Her name's Jerry, and she used to be a librarian, and she's awesome, she's probably one of my favorite people, one of my favorite people, again, um, I have a lot of, she's, Jerry's in my top ten, um, cause she's my first regular, I've been doing her hair for, coming up on four years now, she was, when I was working in the mall, she was watching me from outside of the salon, and then came in, and I had already worked like a ten hour day that day, um, because I had a lot of friends coming in that day, and, she was watching me, and then she came up to me and said, Hey, do you have time to cut my hair? And I was like, Oh, yeah, whatever, I'll stay. Because when you first start out, you tend to burn yourself out really easily. But it was okay, because I was not burnt out yet, and I was ready to do Jerry's hair. She's been coming to me ever since. And she moved, recently moved away, and apparently she got married. She's a retired librarian. And she got married, ran away, or moved away. I want to say run away and got married, but that's not the case because she's a little bit smarter than that. Um, it had been planned. Sorry, I need to watch some of Samantha, Samantha's tutorials because my makeup's a little, little smudged right there. I need to see if she can give me some tips on how to fix it. Okay, well, I've been rambling for eight minutes. I am sorry. I tend to do that. I am excited about today. I have an awesome day. I'm almost fully booked. It's my first Saturday at this salon, and I'm super excited. If you want to make me fully booked, please contact me, because I think I have a 3 o'clock and a 4 o'clock open still. So, that's that. Have a lovely day. Goodbye.